welcome back to another week of Circle of Hope. Kids time! Oh, it's Daniel and Catboy joining us. Did you guys wear any costumes this week? Like Chris and Martin? I mean, Catboy and Gecko are wearing? Well, maybe you did, maybe you didn't. Did you do anything fun this week that we can look at together and enjoy? Well, let's take a look. sharing those videos and those pictures. It's nice to see you because we can't be together in person. Now, today is actually a special holiday. Do you know what holiday it is? I think it's character day. Okay. It's one that Christians have celebrated for many years and it's called All Saints Day. Huh. Mm -hmm. Have you ever heard of that before? No, no, no. No, no it's character day. And what is a saint? There's a couple ways to describe it. One way I think of it is someone who's followed Jesus um, and really loved him and who isn't alive anymore. So it's someone in the past who's really followed Jesus well. Now on All Saints Day, we can remember some great saints and what their lives can teach us about God. Have you ever heard of Saint Teresa of Avila? I heard it last night. Oh. Mom was talking about it for our kids' time video, which is this. <laughs> well, St. Teresa ah. is an interesting person. We have a painting of her here, but I don't have a photograph of her. You know why? Because she was born in the year 1515, and photography didn't even exist. That was so long ago. <laughs> So, St. Teresa of Avila was born in Spain. That's a country you have to cross the ocean to get to from here. And she really loved knowing God. God! You know what was so cool about her life? Is that when she solved problems, she worked really hard to get people to come and to change them. And she also loved praying. She would spend hours praying and try different ways of praying. And she would write books about it. And those books that people wrote still can teach us more about God today. I think that's so cool and special that people have been listening to Jesus and following him for so many years. I think it's special that we can learn about people and how they follow God. Because we meet, might each be able to bring our own personality and our own gifts into the way we follow God. Hmm. Do you know any people who aren't alive today but had a life that could teach you something about God? One person that comes to my mind was my Grampy. He's not alive anymore. And he was a reverend that's kind of like a pastor. And something special about his life that taught me a lot about God was that when he was a very old man, he was still learning things about God even though his whole life he'd been teaching people the Bible. But when he was really old, he learned how to pray to Jesus like all the time every day and learned that he could be friends with him like that rather than just sometimes in special buildings or special 
celebrations. So wouldn't it be cool if we could together remember saints of the past, and maybe even draw a picture and thank God for them? I happened to draw a picture of my grampy to remember him. He was very um, old when I knew him. He had glasses, he had gray hair on the sides. Sometimes he would let me brush the sides of his hair with my Barbie brush. It would be teeny tiny and he would let me brush it. And I thank God for him because he showed me that even if I'm old, that I can still be learning new things about Jesus. Isn't that cool? Well, we've got some fun, um, a fun song that we can sing together now. So why don't we do that together? When I rise, let me rise like a bird joyfully with no regrets and gracefully. When I rise, let me rise like a bird joyfully with no regrets and gracefully. When I fall, let me fall like a leaf, joyfully, with no regrets, and gracefully. When I fall, let me fall like a leaf, gracefully, with no regrets, and joyfully, and joyfully. I really like that song, did you? It felt perfect for fall, since we're in the fall season. Well, thank God for Saint Teresa. Thank God for Saint Grampy. And I hope you can celebrate a saint and draw their picture, or think of your own way to celebrate a saint. And it'd be awesome if you could draw, take a picture and send it in, we'd love to see it. So hope you have a great week. Enjoy All Saints Day. Bye-bye.